with another banger for you guys today. And as you can see by the title, we have a brand new SML movie. This dropped about 10 minutes ago and it is called SML Movie Cody Dies. So it seemed like this is going to be a, a controversial episode. And while we're on this topic, it, I know Jeffy's the most popular character, but who is the second most popular character out there for SML? Is it Cody? Let me know in the comment section down below and let's dive right into this video. If you guys would like to see more reaction videos, make sure you guys subscribe to the TikTok. Link will be in the description down below as well as the Call of Duty Gaming page on Facebook. And make sure you guys are subscribed to this channel with notifications turned on so you do not miss any of the uploads. And let's dive right into this tragic, tragic episode. <laughs> Of my oh, boy you know Cody. Ain't dropping on my watch. Oh, that Cody dies. Is hectic, y'all. There's a no balloon touching the ground. I'm thinking about oh, Ken. Totally they got Ken in the Turn background. They needed you know Ken for this episode. Game, Joseph, until Cody gets here. Bro, Cody's late, and you know I wanted to play this bluey balloon game all day. But we promised. Oh, it's Cody starting already. Start He's late for a reason. Plus, we need three players. Uh, well, Ken's here. Can he play in place of Cody? No, Cody <laughs> left Ken here last night, and we can't play with Ken because Ken's a doll. So that was Cody's last time seeing Ken last night. The wait for Cody to get here before we can start. Playing. And look, Cody's mom was supposed to drop him off an hour ago. They must have hit traffic or something. God. Well, what are we gonna do until he gets here? Um, we can watch TV. <laughs> the news. Boy Dude, killed in car accident. Car. Okay, they, this is hectic. Okay, so it's like actually happening right now in SML, accident guys. on the interstate a few moments ago that claimed the life of a 15-year-old boy named Cody Nutkiss. We have an exclusive interview with his parents now. Oh, no, Cody. Oh, it's horrible. I'm so sorry. Tyrone don't even care. Oh, baby, don't cry. I'll explain why it's not your fault. It was just a freak accident. Look, see, my wife right here, she a freak. Great A. See, she was drinking and driving and texting. And then around the <laughs> oh, shit. Me and it starts giving me roll dome. I'm talking about. Whoa, oh, whoa, 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 whoa. So Tyrone basically exposing his wife on top of exposing. The, he's exposing her in multiple ways. The fact that she's the reason, quote unquote, that they got in a car accident and she was giving him road dome. Yeah, like, talk about fuck? a risk taker. Man, we swerving all on the road and then we go off road. And I say, hey, baby, watch out for that huge Imagine tree. if this is how you really took your son out. And I was like, damn, girl. Ooh, you nasty. I'm going to let you keep doing what you're doing. And then, yeah, we hit that tree going 65 miles per hour. Man, it was crazy. So uh, how did y'all not get hurt in the front seat? I buckled up in the back seat. So uh, he flew out the sunroof, decapitated his ass. Yeah, his body was in the car. His head was out there in the woods with Bambi. Man, blood all in the seats. I'm talking about nasty. We're going to have to get that out of his allowance to clean up the seats. <laughs> the Tyrone is so fucked up right now. This is the worst news case. He's making us look horrible right the now, worst right? Part? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, okay, his mom, so, look, Cody's mom looks horrible, too. Focus or explore. They disrespect the Cody so bad. Uh, we only want to spend that $3,000. If it's on Marketplace, we want to buy it right now. So, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Reach out for your boy. What? Cody's dead? Dude, I hated him, but I didn't want him to die. Really? Like, Cody's dead? Like, he's not coming back? Bro, why does everybody in my life have to die? Joseph and Joseph and Junior actually are more hurt by this thing than Tyrone and Cody's mom. All right, Joseph, it's ringing. Come on, Cody, please don't be dead. Answer the phone. Hey there, it's Cody. All I do is answer the phone and fuck, and I didn't answer the phone, so <laughs> leave a message after the beep. Fucking beep. <laughs> He's a fucking beep. I'm gonna lie, Cody. He just censored out his own cuss word. Oh, it was pretty savage. I need one like that. I'm not gonna lie. I'm totally gonna make my voicemail just like that once we hang up. <laughs> Ooh, I miss him, dude. The emotional oh, episode. He's cutting out into your room. Oh, you nerdy freak. I miss you. Wait, wait. <laughs> my phone says it has one new voicemail. From Cody. Well, let me see what it's from. Joseph, Cody left us a voicemail 30 minutes ago, but I didn't hear my phone because it was on silent. Let's hear what he has to say. Hey, Junior, I'm on my way to your house right now. You fuckers better not be playing that bluey balloon game without me. Whoa, baby, watch out for that big tree. What am I, Max? All right, dude. Having the voicemail, <laughs> I get what Tyrone was saying already without even continuing. But having the voicemail and hearing the voicemail of your friend potentially dying is insane, bro. Like, no. Freak, uh, keep going in. <laughs> oh, hold on. My mom is giving my dad road dome while driving. Let me put my seatbelt on. Oh, shit! Oh, what happened? You crashed into a tree. I told you to watch out. Do you want me to finish giving you road dome? No, not right now. The car is on fire. It might explode. Grab Cody. Fuck Cody. Oh, oh no, baby. Oh, look at Cody. Oh, his head is gone. Oh, no, poor Cody. Oh, baby, we got to get out. Run. Come on. 
and then the car blew up. Dispatch, we have an 1180 in progress, and we need to block off all traffic going northbound. 2008 Ford Explorer crashed into a tree and exploded. There's a child's body missing a head. I found his. This is the voicemail of a century right here, okay? <laughs> here. Oh, a deer is biting it. Oh, I found the kid's phone over here. He was calling someone named Junior. Hey, guys, he was leaving a voicemail. Come over here. Hey, your friend is fucking dead. I'm gonna look at this like a fucking jack o' lantern. I'm gonna punt this bitch like a football. Oh, oh shit, they disrespected the fuck out of Cody, bro. <laughs> Damn. Look, bro, like 70 yards. I told you I should have been in the NFL. <laughs> Oh shit! He said just got ran over by a semi-truck. Oh, no, 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 no,
it's a clone machine, yeah, so yeah. it clones things. Yeah. So when I put the Q-tip with Cody's juice on it from Ken's ass in there, it just cloned the Q-tip with more booty juice. Yeah, but didn't give us <laughs> with that. more booty that juice. Would need to be like that. <laughs> hey, these niggas wild. The rebirth <laughs> machine type thing. Damn, where do we find that at? Let me go call like a nerd or something. Yeah. Hey there, did somebody call a nerd? Yeah, our friend got the cap. Not Jonathan. Oh, I'm so sorry to hear that. Yeah, shit was brutal, dude. Yeah, it was very disturbing. He left us a voicemail. We can hear the whole thing. You want to hear it? No, no. See, I just got. I wouldn't want to hear that shit either. But I already did. With you guys. Toes doing some unimaginable things, and I want to keep that in my noggin. You know, saving in the spank bank for later. Why don't you just watch hey, the video no. later? Because my mom has parental controls on my laptop set for 8 p.m. And I'm a 9 p.m. spent kind of guy. That makes sense. Yeah. Yeah, so what can I do for you? Zesty boys? ass well, boy. We're clone our Little horn dog. Kind of in the car accident, and he likes to jeeb all over the back of this Ken doll. So I took a Q tip and I swabbed his butt, and I thought if I took the Q tip with our friend's DNA on it and put it in the clone machine, that it would clone our friend. But it, it cloned the, the Q tip. Q -tip. Yeah, I've had this happen for me before, too. See, this one time I tried to clone myself using a crusty sock. See, I wanted another version of myself so I could bend them over like sketch and have them say, What's up, brother? But it didn't work. See, what <laughs> you need is a d -d -d DNA splicing machine. Oh, what is that? What the fuck is that? It's a machine that uses DNA in order to make a perfect clone. Okay, well, where are we going? Interesting. Oh, I have some extra aluminum foil and a blue sharpie. Just give me a moment. Okay. All right, boys, your d -d -d DNA splicing machine is ready. <laughs> Imagine if you had a machine that could be any machine oh, you want, as long as you put the name on front of it. That would be insane. DNA splicing machine. I mean, Cody does it better, but... Yeah, a little bit. All right, so wait, did you just cover up the words cook a clone machine with more tinfoil and wrote the DNA splicing machine on it? Yes, because that's how it works. Uh, okay, so um, let me just swab his butt again and see. All right, do I just put it in there? Yeah, you just put it in there. And now, we wait. We might actually get Cody back. Yay, I miss my little nerd. Ooh, it's done. He's going to come back straight. Birthday. Oh, God, I wish he was still dead. Somebody please kill him. So, is this your friend Damn. That's decapitated? Wait, I get decapitated? Yeah, you were in a car accident. Your mom was driving, giving your dad road dome. It was a whole thing. Wait, what happened to your face? Oh, I went outside and found a stray cat. I thought <laughs> it was you reincarnated, but it wasn't. <laughs> what? And why is Ken's ass out? He's going to catch a cold. Oh, uh, well, we were trying to get you come back alive, so we thought if we took a Q-tip and got some of your Jeep juice off of Ken's butt, <laughs> and put it in the <laughs> machine, it was Cody been going crazy with that dog. Jeep juice to work with, but what the hell's going on? What did I miss? All right, Cody, you want to know the truth? Yeah? The voice actor of you was gone for the week. It was a really rough week without you because we didn't have Broken Guy and we didn't have any of the other characters. So we, we just had to think of the stupidest ideas. Like, we made this Cocoa Puss Bird <laughs> video, which I thought was funny. <laughs> yeah. But it did really bad. And now this week they're going to say we're out of, we ran out of ideas and that we suck at what we do. But now you're back. Oh, oh, good. I'm glad I'm back. Yeah, because, you know, if you noticed, your mom was played by that guy. Oh, Cody. Oh, that's not that. <laughs> yeah, that's I did not know, Anthony. Bro, how the fuck is Anthony so good at making all the good, fucking voices, Lavelle, bro? He was going to try to voice like, a clone of you. Let's hear your impression. Uh, like penis. Uh, he's not a dog, Jojo. Yeah, that's pretty That's pretty rough. Yeah, so good thing we didn't go with that ending, because you came back this weekend. Enough time for us to get the ending. Yeah. Yeah, it all worked out. Yeah, so, now where'd you go anyway? Oh, uh, Panama so, City. So, by the way, I'm going to take this now. Thank you! Okay. Wait, where'd you go? Uh, I went to Panama City. How was that? That was cool. I went to Dave & Buster's. Twice, actually. Wait, tw tw twice? Two times, yeah. money. The money, man! <laughs> Dave & Buster's big money is crazy. I only paid the one time, and then I came back. Oh, wait. With the card I got from the day before. Uh, how many How many tickets did you win? About 800. Mm. What'd you get? What kind of prize did you get with that? Just candy. Candy. What? Oh yeah, you can't get. You're shit. almost fuck. You're th almost thirty, and you ate candy. Well, yeah, oh, I like candy. Okay. You're I'm not a candy person candy. either, y'all. I don't eat candy like that. Good. I want to know what they tasted like. Is either that or a big ass stick of like sugar candy? You know, this big like, pixie. The pixie candy. sticks. Yeah. What was your favorite game? Um, I, I like I like the hoops. Of, of course, well, the driving ones are fun. I like I played a snowmobile. You drove two day That's your. You could just you. you I, I didn't drive a snowmobile, but I. <laughs> Well, the episode ended awkwardly, but at least that boy Cody came back. What started off as a controversial episode turned into be just 
like footage that they needed because Cody was gone. You feel me? So hey, another banger as always, man. Let me know what you guys think in the comment section down below. If you guys would like to see more reactions, please subscribe to the TikTok. Link will be in the description down below, man. Appreciate you guys for all the continued support. That does it for this video, and I will see you guys in the next one, baby. We are out. Peace.